Well, like I was telling Kurt, I was super proud of our team and our players, just where we are in the season. We had a tough game against Wake, and we're finding ourselves and trying to grow, and I thought we took a big step toward growing today, and that's good for them to experience that. Obviously, it's nice against an SEC team. That's always nice, and it's kind of different and special in its own way, but it really just please our approach to this game the last two or three practices, uh, and then how they got into it, and just for them, hopefully that gives them some confidence as we move forward. Well, I think they grow because everything's more important, like getting back on defense, the right pass, tough for the ball, mm -hmm. because they, the size that they have, um, the quickness that they have at this level, you know, there's no room for error. So that's how you can get tougher. And so yeah. when you can see how hard you got to pass it or how hard you got to cut yes. or be able to score over somebody that's contesting around the goal, those are the ways you can get better and grow. And, and I thought we didn't back down from that. We started the game, I think, seven to nothing. Mm -hmm. And that was really a great thing to see. Um, and, and we've got some tough kids, and, I, and it was good to, for them to experience that and grow. That's, that's got to be good to see. It's a great thing. Um, it's really what we want to see. Mm -hmm. We're sharing the ball. Um, you know, two of them are freshmen, so Katie and Samantha played well, and obviously Hannah scored. And, and so just to be able to have that um, uh, uh, balance is what you want inside and out. And, you know, Brittany, as you guys talked to a minute, you know, their heart and soul and gets them the ball. She always gets the ball where we need to get to, and she can break down the defense. And they can be the recipient of that because she breaks down the defense. But we always want balance, and that was good to see tonight. Yeah, in some way I wish we kind of played here in the next two or three days, but not really. Uh, I'm looking forward to Christmas, but it, it should, I think, because just like we use tape to show them some things we got to work on, mm -hmm. things that got we, we didn't look good in, we'll do the same thing with this Georgia tape. Show them how, see, when you execute, when you do this, you know, you making plays and give them confidence. So I hope it does. We've got a tournament, obviously, down in Florida, Gulf Coast, right after the Christmas break, and then right after New Year's, we, we open up with Chad, who's not bad. And uh, so hopefully that carries over. And, and, and the progress of our team. Right, it doesn't. It's awesome. And especially uh, the past couple days of practice, we've been focusing on our preparation and our attitude going into a game, uh, especially a non-conference game against someone like Georgia or someone like Wake Forest. And entering the game really just with confidence and knowing that we belong out there with them and we are capable of beating them. And the past couple of times we've played big schools, Kentucky, Wake, we've come out scared or a little hesitant, but this time we came out really aggressive and confident and I was really proud of us because we've been kind of working on that attitude for the past couple days in practice. In the conference it should give us so much confidence knowing that if we outplay, out hustle, uh, work harder than other teams and even if they may be bigger or more athletic we can still beat them and I think that's really good to know going into our conference play. You know Katie Allen works harder than anyone on our team, and it's so cool to see, and she hasn't really gotten the credit, but it's cool that she got her, her chance to go out there and play tonight, and we're, we could not be happier for her. She is such an amazing, she's an amazing girl and such a great addition to our team, so we're really proud of her.